And now on to our dinosaur of the day, Shiaosaurus, which was a request from Tyrant King via our Patreon and Discord, so thanks. It was an Ornithischian dinosaur that lived in the Middle Jurassic and what is now Sichuan, China, in the Xia Sha Shi Miao Formation. It was herbivorous and lightly built. It's on the small side for a dinosaur. It's estimated to be about one meter long or a little over three feet. That is very small. Yes. Its femur, or its thigh bone, is only 11 centimeters, or a little over four inches long. Yeah, that's much smaller than ours. I'm used to the femurs being just these huge measurements, way bigger than ours. Which What are ours, like a foot, foot and a half? Maybe this one's in the running for, uh, would make a good pet. I think so, yeah. <laughs> it walked on two legs. It had a long tail, short arms. Its legs were muscular, and it had a small head. It also had leaf-shaped teeth. Two individuals were found in 1979 and 1980, and then it was named in 1983 by Dong Jiming and Tang Zilu. The type species is Xiaosaurus dashanpensis. The genus name Xiaosaurus means dawn lizard, and it refers to the age of the dinosaur. Meaning that it was early? Middle Jurassic, yeah. The species name refers to Dashanpu, which is the township near where the fossils were found. The holotype is a partial skeleton with a jaw fragment with a tooth, neck and tail bones, an upper arm bone, a partial left thigh bone, and a complete right leg. And then the second skeleton found includes a right thigh bone, vertebrae, a phalanx, a finger or toe bone, a rib, and two teeth. There was briefly another species. Well, it wasn't really accepted, but in 1992, Peng Guangzhou reclassified Agilosaurus multidens as Xiaosaurus multidens, but again, that wasn't really accepted. And Xiaosaurus multidens later became Hushin Lusaurus. Xiaosaurus was too fragmentary to be easily classified, and sometimes it was thought to be a nomum dubium. A 2005 study found it to be valid, though, and said that it was an Ornithischia incerte sedis, so some sort of Ornithischian. <laughs> that is just one notch shy of being an invalid name. Yes. Because Ornithischia is very broad. Yeah, but hey, still works. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I guess one notch above that is it's like a dinosauromorph or something. <laughs> Shiaosaurus lived in a lush forest. Other dinosaurs that lived around the same time and place include Ornithischians like Hush and Lusaurus and Agilosaurus, as well as sauropods. One of them is Omasaurus, which is known for its really long neck, and Shunosaurus, which is known for having a tail club, even Ooh, though it's nice. a sauropod. Yeah. And then there's also theropods, many, many types of theropods, and stegosaurs like Huayangosaurus. That one had pointy spikes on their backs. Some other animals that lived around the same time and place include fish, amphibians, turtles, crocodiles, and pterosaurs. For those of you who listen to our Dinosaur of the Day segment and you like it, please consider becoming a patron. We take new Dinosaur of the Day requests from our patrons and offer a bunch of other perks as well. So check out our page at patreon.com slash or click the link on the left. <laughs> 